Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a 2020 Volkswagen Atlas Cross Sport SE Tech 4 motion in a turbo. This is pure gray on the outside with dark black leather red interior. Features the 20 inch alloy wheels, LED running lights, LED all weather lights, LED all, I'm sorry, LED headlights and the new aggressive chin that the Atlas shares with it right down here at the bottom and the three rib grille with the new Volkswagen logo in the middle there. Now you'll notice if you've watched enough of these videos or you've seen enough Atlases that the inner LED running light is not on. That's because this has a different headlight, headlight display. This doesn't have the adaptive front steering headlights so there's only one outer uh, LED lit up on each of these uh, headlights. If you have the AFS, it has two LED running lights on each side. This one features silver roof rails, the Cross Sport logo, or, I'm sorry, badge right there. Keyless entry on all four doors. LED tail lights, chrome accents at the base of the tail lights across. The Atlas name badge right there underneath the Volkswagen logo, the new Volkswagen logo. And need I mention anything about this pure gray exterior color? This is super, super, super sharp. Oversized reflector there. There's your fake exhaust tips on the back there, the chrome ones. I gotta call it for what it is, they are fake. This being a turbo, it won't have the trailer hitch. The V6 version, you can add a trailer hitch. This one does have, however, the added $1,200 option for a panoramic sunroof. And the paint is a 395 upgrade. This one appears to be missing the window sticker here, so if I come across it, it'll go over that. Otherwise, I'll post in the comments the uh, price on this one. Wood grain interior right here. It's kind of a pinkish brown color right here. Kind of cool. Power door locks, power windows. Uh, window lock right here. One touch up, one touch down on those windows. The heated mirrors are now integrated into the defrost settings. Uh, the rear defroster right there. So you don't have the little icon down here. You do have a power lift gate right there. As I slowly pan around here and I can lift up on that and hold it and that closes that lift gate. Volkswagen's flat bottom leather wrapped steering wheel with the new Volkswagen logo in the center. The flat silver finish across the spokes here. Nice setup there. Volume control right here. Song skip, preset skip right here. You do also have a coin box for storage down here and a telescoping steering wheel. Pull out, push in, raise it, lower it, lock it in wherever you want. As you see my socks down there, there's a little bit of blue and a little bit of gray today. It has the standard Volkswagen instrumentation here with the customizable LCD screen in the middle. That's nice that you can mess with the radio, you can add a compass, your assist systems. You can pull them up right here. You have blind spot monitoring, rear traffic alert, and front assist as well. Same flat bottom or flat dash that you have. A little bit of, it's, it's kind of soft to the touch here uh, with this little storage tray right here that you have in a regular Atlas. It's a little pliable there too. That's the only hump on it. So you get quite a bit of visibility there. This being a cross sport, it's like, it drives like the Atlas with the feel of a coupe. Nice coupe lines there as you look back there. Okay, so all of these do have a black headliner. Here's that panoramic sunroof on this car. Giant panoramic sunroof with the power sunshade. I'll open that up for you. There's a pop-up windscreen right there. Nice blue sky today. This particular one does come with the home link mirror, which is uh, auto dimming with the compass and three-door garage door memory right there. As we look in the glove box here, I'm looking for that window sticker. That's what I'm kind of doing here. I'm kind of going around the horn here. Uh, here's a look at the SD card reader right here. Um, right here, I should say, at the CD player. And then an SD card reader or hold, SD card holder right here. There's a look at that wood grain interior as it continues across the dash and into the door over there. AM, FM, and satellite radio. With App Connect, App Connect allows you to do Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, or MirrorLink using one of these two USBs right here. Also, there's wireless charging right here as well, so you can charge your phone in the case right there. You do have a 12-volt adapter port right there, and then also a auxiliary port right there. So with this car, it does have a uh, backup camera that's pretty fantastic. 
what trajectory is steering. You turn the wheel left or right, the yellow line moves accordingly to show you where you're headed. You can also turn that off and get your sensor, the park sensor on here. This is your park pilot sensors. As you get close to an object here, these little lines show up and move closer to the front end. And same with the back end. You can ch change the pitch and sound of that as well. Dual climate zone for you. I'm going to go ahead and close the sunroof here for you so we can show you uh, that this has something called air care as well. So I can pull this up right here. I can bring up my climate control right there on the screen. Or... I can do the knobs down here. Now, air care, this is an air filtration system. This little blue line expands to cover the entire cabin. That's scrubbing the air. So if you have allergies or you are allergic to certain things, uh, if you're highly sensitive to certain smells, aromas, or cigarette smoke, things of that nature, it's going to filter it out before it circulates it through the cabin. Pretty nice that it does all that. Here's a look at the key fob right here. So it has your remote start functionality right there, your hatch, uh, lock and unlock, of course, and then the panic alarm on the side right there. Two cup holders right up front here. The push button start is right here. Push button down here instead of up on the side wall up here by the vents. Uh, Volkswagens do that. And then you have that electronic parking brake. And to take it off, you just put your foot on the brake and push down on it. There's that park pilot sensor where I, on demand, bring up my rear view camera there. And then I can also turn it off. That radio super nice radio touch screen all these buttons are all touch except for the two knobs right here here's a look at the leatherette seats with the bold white stitching on the sides these are heated seats up front the armrest is also leatherette with the bold white stitching and if you look inside there's another usb port right here lots of room for storage in here for maybe a, a medium-sized purse amazon sells some drop-in trays you can put in here as well uh, that store that holds uh, quite a bit in here so let's take a look at the back seat. Guys, I am not finding the window sticker on this, so I'll end up posting it online. And one thing I did fail to mention here, lumbar support, forward and back, and seat back all adjust right there. As you look at that driver's seat with the manual adjust headrest, white bowl stitching there, thick bolster there. And if you're a wide-bodied individual, a little bit on the plus side, you're still going to have comfort in this seat. It doesn't matter. These seats are super comfortable, road-tested, definitely road-tested. So if you're familiar with the Atlas, you're going to be really familiar with this seat right here. This is the same seat as they use in the bench seat of the Atlas, with the exception of a couple of things. Right there in the middle, there are no latch hookups for car seats, but you have them on the outside right here and also over there. Lots of storage in this car for bottles and cups and things of that nature. They're over here as well. Here's a look through from the center to the back to the center radio entertainment system right there, the armrest, center console, climate control is all controlled up front. This is a little cubby here on a regular Atlas. There's controls here for you. Then you got two USBs down here as well as a three volt, I'm sorry, a three prong, uh, 115 volt plug in there where you can charge a laptop. As we look back up here again, there's a look at your instrument cluster, instrumentation right there. Uh, here's a look at that giant panoramic sunroof. Once again, goes all the way back, covers the entire passenger cabin. Carnet is free for three, I'm sorry, for five years on this car. So that's your roadside assistance uh, access right there and also emergency services and information. Now I should point out though that the roadside assistance is only free for three years or 36,000 miles through Volkswagen, but Carnet services are free for five years. There's a look at that foldable armrest right there and cup holder. These seats will fold flat, but let's take a look at the back here. Well, actually, I'm going to try to do this with one hand, so I apologize if this fails miserably. But I'm going to lift up on that, and I can fold this seat flat. It does drop down about an inch to an inch and a half below the floor in the back. That's because the seat's set lower here to accommodate this sloping roof line right here for rear passengers, so they don't lose out on headroom. Now, there is also, before I go to the back here, these velcro mats right here and a lot of people are saying what are these for these two extra mats well this one's for the larger seat here this attaches here to cover this gap so things that you have stored don't fall through the gap into the back of the seat same with this little one over here so i will go to the back here and open up the back so we can see what we have here and by the way this seat does recline as well another thing that's really cool iq light if you can see that right there it says iq light these are smart LED headlights and taillights. 
It's a new system. And uh, it's available now in the U.S. on the uh, Atlas and the Atlas Crossport. Cargo containment blocks, they attach to this like Velcro. And then you also have these uh, monster mats here. But look at the amount of space that you have for cargo in this car. Bag hooks right here and also right here. Trunk light here and also here. And it's carved out here for extra space. You can get all kinds of things back here. Power lift gate right there. We're going to close that up. There's a look at the LED tail lights. Again, the oversized reflector. Look at how the sun reflects off of this pure gray color. Super, super sexy car. This car comes with a four year, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty on it from Volkswagen. That's four years, 50,000 miles, bumper to bumper from Volkswagen. Also, if you buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's here in St. Louis, you're going to get a 10 year, 200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge. That's right, 10 year, 200,000 mile engine and powertrain warranty that's nationwide and free of charge to you. So if you're interested in this car, please give me a call, 636-290-4257, 636-290-4257. I'm on Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter at Reese Sells Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a great day. Stay safe. Stay healthy.